I definitely look like a serial killer or something out of a scary movie. Morning guys, what's up? Welcome back to another vlog or welcome if you're new. I'm about to head into the gym right now and get my workout on. It's actually 7.30 a.m. which is earlier than I usually get here so I'm proud of myself. I woke up and I was feeling spongy and just ready to like get out of bed right away. So here we are. Got my BCAAs. I'm just gonna go warm up on the treadmill and then today I'm doing shoulders and then I think I'm gonna throw in a little bit of biceps and triceps because of my tattoo removal this week. My arm was swollen so I missed my like upper body bicep tricep day so I think that would be good to get some of that in. I also want to quickly thank Later for sponsoring today's video. They're a really cool platform for you to organize all of your content across all of your social media channels and you guys I'm super pumped to show you guys how I kind of plan and organize my content for the boutique. I know a lot of you guys love seeing the behind the scenes and when you're trying to plan out the perfect feed and you have content to post across multiple platforms it's really helpful to use a program like Later but we'll get more into that later in the video so let's go work out. from the gym just made the most delicious bowl of oatmeal ever i actually like really wanted brown sugar cinnamon oatmeal like you get the little packs you know when you were little but i don't have the packs i just have like a whole container of oatmeal so i just put a ton of cinnamon in it and a teaspoon of brown sugar and it tastes so freaking good i got the consistency of like milk to oatmeal ratio perfect i love a good bowl of oatmeal <laughs> a little bit later now I obviously showered and put makeup on got dressed and everything and I'm actually at the brow place I'm gonna get my eyebrows laminated and tinted before this weekend I'm going to Tampa this weekend I'm super pumped and so I thought I would get my eyebrows done they don't look super bad right now because I did fill them in because I had some errands to run before I got here and I didn't want to be walking around with like my terrible eyebrows so I got them filled in but I am about to go get them laminated again and this is my second time ever getting them laminated and then also tinted Guys, it's almost two o'clock now. I don't even know what the heck happened to this day. Um, I mean, the day's not completely over, but I went and got my eyebrows done and I also got my hair done and I didn't vlog any of that hardly because 
I was frantically rushing from the eyebrow place to the hair salon and I for sure thought I wasn't gonna make it on time. There was no way I could pull out my camera and I'm actually sad because I got really pretty longer extensions put in. So I had her take out the other ones that I had in with the shorter hair. I had some in just for fullness and we replaced it with these longer ones and they're not that much longer. Um, the color is still the same, but I really like them. I feel like this little bit of added length was kind of nice for me, but I had like a super cute idea to do an Instagram reel or a TikTok and do like a transition of my hair and I didn't do it because time was not on my side today. Just put my glasses on because of course my eyes just cannot seem to make it an entire day with contact lenses. But anyway, I'm about to start working on planning out content for Sunstyled, um, basically just the Instagram content right now, and so I feel like it's the perfect time to talk to you guys about the sponsor of today's video, which is Later. I've been using their platform for a while now to plan out the perfect feed for Sunstyled, and it makes my life so easy because when I have things going on, like this weekend, for example, I'm gonna be out of town, I don't have to sit here and think about staying consistent on social media because I automate everything and I plan it all out, including the captions, the photos, I'm going to post. You can do Instagram stories, Facebook posts, Pinterest pins. You can even schedule TikToks. So you really have no excuse not to stay consistent. And we all know the key to growing your social media is consistency. So Later really helps make that easier for me. So here's a look at my calendar on Later. You can see some of the posts that I have scheduled previously. Right now, I've only been using Later for Instagram. But as I said, you guys can use it to schedule for Pinterest, for Facebook. Twitter and TikTok, so it's really helpful to make sure that you are getting the most out of the content you produce because you might as well share it to all of your platforms. Since I'm gonna be away this weekend, I'm gonna show you guys how I schedule through the weekend. So the first thing you wanna do is drag over the files that you want to upload over into your media library and they will hang out right here where you can then go and schedule them into your calendar. I just dragged mine over and I have a bunch of posts right now. They're still kind of loading in. So as you guys can see, the sun styled theme is very pink and orange beachy summertime kind of style right now. So I just picked out photos that kind of coordinate with that. This one I've actually already posted, so I will just delete that one. But the rest of these I don't think I've used yet, so we should be good. I do plan on posting once more today, so I am gonna go ahead and schedule this one. I think I'm gonna schedule it for like four o'clock because I think the last one I posted was several hours ago. This is just a picture of some bracelets and you can go ahead and type out whatever caption you want to make your life so much easier. So not only are you planning out the photos you're gonna post, but the caption and everything. You guys are totally getting a little sneak preview of the sale I'm doing this weekend, so I just went ahead and typed that all out, and then I'll add a couple of hashtags. Up here is where you can choose auto-publish, or if you want it to send a notification to your phone and then just kind of let you know, hey, reminder, it's time for you to post. I like to do the notification version because sometimes I do randomly decide to post differently than what I scheduled for. Then I click save and it just schedules it right here on my calendar. And now I'm gonna go ahead and do that for the rest of them. And normally I wouldn't post so many times throughout the day, but I've been doing that lately because I'm really trying to build up an aesthetic looking feed. So I've been posting a little more often than I think what is recommended. I think you can just do like one post a day and that's probably more than enough. 
So that's how I've been planning out my feed. I've actually been asked a few times, which makes me feel so good because obviously my sun styled feed is looking really good if you guys have noticed that. And it makes me feel like I'm doing something right. And if you guys wanna check out later, they are offering you one month free of their growth plan. That's the plan that I currently use and it's super helpful. So you'll get access to all of the features I have and that full social set. So you can link all of the social media channels that you're currently using, whether it's personal or for your business. The link for the discount and the code will be in the description box below. And they Thank you so much to later for sponsoring today's video guys this is the current state of my office right now like this is so bad i've got boxes and boxes of inventory that i need to go through and i just went through a bunch but i honestly just ordered so much after i did my name change and it's now all coming in so this is a little crazy but i just went through and like pulled some sizes out of each item for most of this. I have some models who I'm going to shoot wearing this stuff this weekend and I don't really feel like going through all of it right now. I had some leftover pasta for dinner and now I'm just gonna make a little iced tea with my Tazo black tea. Much later and I am going to do this Dr. Jart Ceramidin facial barrier mask because my skin really needs a little bit of hydration and I have yet to use this one so I'm actually pretty excited to try it. Got the face mask on. It feels really, really good, but I definitely look like a serial killer or something out of a scary movie. Love that. I think this is supposed to sit on for 15 or 20 minutes. Just took the face mask off and I definitely recommend that one. I really liked it. It was super hydrating. Didn't irritate my skin at all. In fact, I just like kind of rubbed it into my skin afterwards and my skin feels very happy right now. So I'm happy with that. I'm sitting here snuggling my little baby and I might play Animal Crossing, but that is pretty much it for the rest of this vlog. I'm going to go ahead and get changed and I think I'm either going to play Animal Crossing or read my book. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. And if you're not already subscribed, be sure to click that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next video.